that image next to you there of yourself 30 years ago. Uh, how does it feel now, 30 years on? It's an, it's an iconic image. You just realised this day now what it what it means, yeah? Yeah, I so say you don't like to... Th you suddenly think, where's those 30 years gone since we lifted that trophy? But when you see... You know, we see a rerun of some of the, the TV footage after the game, and I've got to admit, I do look quite a bit younger than <laughs> I, do, I do now, so that's where those 30 years have gone. But, um, but no, it's, it's amazing that, you know, say it was, it was such an iconic final, you know, the effort that's gone into it to getting the club back to Plough Lane um, and to get this stadium you know, started and going up, and uh, it's been tremendous. And the fact that Everyone has fought so hard to get back there. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's testimony to the spirit and the never say die attitude of this football club. And of course, the 88 side, they feel a, a strong attachment to, to AFC Wimbledon now over the years. I mean, you yourself have kept coming down to the club and taking an interest in, in how it's developed, yeah? Well, this is, you know, it's part of my history, and, and that's the sad thing that when you look at your history, and, you know, many players, when they finish playing football, they, they have a affiliation with their former clubs and they, they go down there they, they might do match day hospitality because they want to be involved and and my Wimbledon is no longer here this is my Wimbledon now you know, so it's a big part of me and, uh, and, and hopefully it'll be ongoing for a long time to go